I haven't been sleeping lately. I mean, I have been. Of course, you cannot not sleep as a human person in the long run without going insane. But I have been mostly not... I wake up more often than I go to sleep some nights, which I know is not literally possible, but it feels like I go to sleep once and then I'm awake. And then I'm awake and I'm awake and I'm awake and I'm awake. During the day, I look out the window, but at night there's nothing to see, so I just... It's not that I'm anxious or depressed. I mean, I am obviously anxious and depressed. I mean, the world right there are just so many reasons why no one will ever be able to sleep again, but that's not why I'm awake. Usually I am awake because I'm excited because there are so many things that I could be doing instead of sleep. Like, I've been working on this dance lately in my head, working out all the choreography while I'm lying there at night, thinking my body could actually be doing something instead of just lying there. Like, it could go... Or even, even something like, and then, so why should I be lying when I could be doing all of that instead? <laughs> I told my therapist, she said, First things first, you cannot have anything in your bedroom that distracts you at all. You cannot have a computer. You cannot have books. You cannot have your dog. You cannot have a candle. You cannot have a vibrator. You cannot have your phone in there with you. And I was like, ha no, seriously. And she was like, no, nothing. You have to train your brain like Pavlo's dog so that it recognizes the bedroom as a sleep space, a place of calm and peace. Your bed must be for sleeping and sex and nothing else. And I was like, ha, what, what sex? <laughs> and she said, ha ha, I don't know. The, the point is, the point is, I think I lost my train of thought. <laughs> Oh, and I said sleep, and she said, oh yes, this is how cognitive behavioral therapy works. You do these little things, regular little behaviors, like rituals, and over time, they will clear your thoughts. They will actually alter the metabolism in your brain, and they will help you sleep. You just concentrate on breathing, don't think, focus on emptying your mind, The thing is, my father is losing his memory. He forgets things, his past, his personality. All of it is disappearing. And there was a time not so long ago, you couldn't put anything past him. He'd be like, Dad. A Polynesian archipelago comprising of 169 islands, and he'd be like, what is Tonga? It was sharp. And now... And... I know sleep is when your mind is supposed to renew itself. Sleep is when the cobwebs are cleared. The waste that accumulates each day, memories are sorted and stored with is irrelevant, is erased, and to allow new connections to be made when the past is cleared away to make way for the future. And thinking about that is not conductive to sleep. <laughs> the truth is, I don't want to be empty. And I want my mind to be cleared.
I don't want what is irrelevant to be erased. I want to do this. 